What is up, YouTube? Tears Janich here, another printful review. And we're gonna see what we're reviewing. Don't know yet. But I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys liking this channel. I appreciate all the feedback I've been getting from you guys. So please keep uh, down. Please comment down below. Let me know what else I can review for you guys. And I will be having a free printful course coming to YouTube shortly. So be on the lookout for that. Um, I think we're going to review the sports bra first. So. See the sports bra. So this is the all over print long line sports bra. Uh, it has four star rating. Uh, sorry, it has a five four point five star rating and has a total of four reviews, which is pretty good for a new product. Um, but yeah, now it is the all over print. Um, so we see how I feel about that. I mean, so far it looks. Looks good so far, right? I mean, and I haven't even opened it up yet. So. There it is. That's sports bra. Um, this is supposed to be very um, supportive. Very supportive. And it does have pads on the inside. Uh, this is a medium, by the way. Hold up again. This is a medium, by the way. Um, and then on the inside, there is a place to put your logo on the back. So basically, this is how the bra is here. And your logo is going to go here in the back. Okay, so let's see what we got here. We got 75% polyester, 25% spandex, and that's the main fabric. The lining is 92% polyester and 8% polyester. This can be machine wash, cold, uh, psycho, do not br uh, bleach. Um, remember, this is a like a dye, I believe it is. So they just print all over it. If you dye this, it will destroy the paint on this. Now, that being said, polyester seems to work better. Polyester and spandex seem to work better than the cotton, as far as the all over print is concerned. So this actually looks really damn nice. Uh, the colors came out, it's popping real nice. Um, it's not faded at, at all. It feels incredibly soft. Um, I am a little concerned that like, you can see the white lining right here. Uh, the white, the, the white sketching, the uh, stitch, the white stitch. The choices were white or black. Per personally, for this outfit, I would prefer it to be pink. But because I have white lining here, I guess it works, but it's not my first choice. Um, the inside is really soft. Uh, being that I've never wore a sports bra before, I couldn't tell you how supportive this is, but I will turn it inside out for you. And that's what the inside looks like. The inside looks like. Um, obviously, I'll let those who know this better than me, you know, tell me what's good and what's bad, but... That's what it looks like. Um, that is the logo in the back. Looks pretty dope. Um, now, the price on this is about $35. I'm probably going to sell this at about 75 or 70. 70 bucks plus shipping and handling. Um, now, another thing I like about these is that it comes in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sizes. Extra small through three um, X. And I do got some people that would prefer the larger sizes. So this is really helpful. Um, it is important 
on this, I think you got to put the size chart on, on there because a lot of people either don't know the bra size or they really know the bra size. So the, uh, the size chart, I think, would be really helpful for that. Um, let's see what else we can put on here. The, it's an all-over print, so the file size, I think, is just... Um, well, actually, no. It's right here. So the inside label, they're recommending 2.5 by 1 inch. And I think... This might be 2.5 and a quarter, or about a half inch, maybe a little more than a half an inch. So kind of give you an idea, okay? Kind of give you an idea if you can see that. The light's kind of funky. Um, now, as far as the front and the back, the print, the, uh, the print size is uh, 26 inches by 26 inches. Um, however, I guess it depends on what kind of bra you're doing too, but for what we're doing here at, at my clothing store, it seems to work better if you just had a nice, simple design in the center. Um, so kind of play with that. But there are some sports bras that look really nice. They have the entire side all over covered. And like I said, that works for them. Um... It does say that, I mean, obviously you guys know this, you know, you want to submit a size, uh, a file that is a PGN or a JPEG. Um, this NGA, however, is an I, is an AI file, a vector file from um, Adobe Illustrator. So keep that in mind, guys. Am I still recording? Yes. Okay, sorry, I had a phone call. Um, so there's that. Um, Jews full blood images to to ensure maximum coverage. Use full blood images with graphics that span across the um, entire uh, the entire dimension of a document. However, if your design covers only part of the print area, make sure that is transparent background. So yeah, just make sure you use the PIG file if you want a transparent background like I did, or the vector file does work on this. And like I said, this NGA is a vector file. So, um, anything else I will put down in the description. Um, like I said, this is actually a really nice design. I really like it. The only flaw I have in it is the, the noticeable white stitch. Uh, it is really soft. I do recommend you adding this to your store. Um, and I will, when my friend tries this out, I will have her, or I'll put in the comments about what she thought about it. So, but anyway guys, thank you for the support. And please subscribe, like, comment, and I, uh, you know, and we also have a way to click on this link down below where you, which will probably help support this channel. Okay guys, thank you.